Tomorrow, families across the U.S. will go to ceremonies to honor their loved ones whose lives were taken too soon. The Wiregrass Angel on. House in Dothan just finished with their program that honored murder victims in our area for the National Day of Remembrance. News 4's Bela Walker was there. So, Bela, tell us about this evening. Yeah, Kinsley, this evening was filled with a lot of emotion. We heard words from guest speakers, the organization, and of course, family members of those victims. And tonight, the focus were those victims. One of them was 21-year-old Paxton Kennedy, who was killed in 2016. His mother had a heart of gratitude for how far she's come and for the help from Wiregrass Angel House. I would not have made it this far without the Angel House because I've learned every step that I make. Um, if, I'm, if I think I'm not doing right or I'm feeling something I shouldn't be feeling, they assure me that I'm doing the right thing. And she says she wouldn't have made it without the Wiregrass Angel House and all of their resources. Kinsley, I think that is just a testament to the power of this organization in the community. And there were several other people in this area that felt the same way that she did. And of course, our hearts and prayers are with them tonight. And Dothan, I'm Bela Walker, your hometown news leader. Always, Bailey Walker, thank you for that report.